Hi guys, it's Cindy from True North Style. I'm back in 2010. I'm doing my Christmas haul for you. I'm just a little bit of a ramble of what I'm loving right now. Um, I'm sorry it's been so long since I've done a video or even really updated my vlog really well, but I have been updating my Tumblr all the time, so make sure you check it out. It's True North Loves. It's truenorthstyle.tumblr.com. My sister uh, got me a couple things. She got me a popcorn machine, which I love because I love popcorn and I don't eat microwave popcorn because it's so bad for you. So I got that finally. And then she also got me this Mark by Mark Jacobs leopard print laptop case. I wanted this as soon as I saw it in Elle magazine. And um, it's just really, really pretty. You can see the print, it's brown, very neutral, very classic. Um, it's just got the neoprene lining. And I love it because I really needed a laptop case. My old one was kind of for old computers. So it was really big and bulky. It didn't fit inside any of my purses. And even it was like pretty bulky just to put in a tote bag. So this one's very slim, pretty much just fits the computer. You can kind of squeeze your charger in there, but um, it fits in all my tote bags and it does fit in a lot of my purses as well. So love it. And because I decided it was stupid to buy a Mulberry laptop bag just because they were super expensive, this is a great um, second best. So very happy with it. Um, other presents, like I don't really get that many gifts because I'm older and and yeah, we don't give a lot of gifts to my family. We don't have I don't have a lot of um, extended family, so just basically have stuff for my boyfriend and my parents. My boyfriend got me a flip video camera. It's the Mino HD. Um, this is how big it is, tiny. And he got me the leopard print one that I wanted. And that's the back. It has like the little screen and the controls. Yeah, very small. I haven't used this yet, but I am going to shoot my next couple videos on this so we can try it out. I'm going to be doing a nail polish collection video because I want to show you guys this nail polish and also like all my other new favorites. And I'm going to be doing um, two more hauls. One's going to be like Boxing Day stuff and some Tabio stuff. And then the other one's going to be um, eBay thrifting and a few other pieces that I've gotten recently. So look out for those videos on this baby. I hear they shoot amazingly well, so I'm pretty excited to try it out. Um, and then my mom and dad got me just a bunch of um, gift cards. They got me some stuff from Victoria's Secret, and they got me um, a new perfume. It's the Dior Mon Cherry. It comes in this hat box. And then it just comes like on this little pillow, which is really great packaging. Um, the perfume itself, it smells like, kind of smells like, smoky and sweet at the same time. It's very Parisian, like you think of, you know, um, macaroons and uh, smoky cafes. That's kind of what it smells like. It's a really great um, night scent. I probably wouldn't wear it um, as much during the day. I have been wearing it a lot, but it's pretty strong, so I've decided to kind of save it for nights and keep using my fresh Strawberry Fields and Chloe for day. But I do really like that. It's beautiful. Um, my mom and dad also got me some new hoops. They're these silver oversized hoops. I've been wearing these pretty much every day since I got them. Um, I love hoops. They're my favorite kind of earring to wear. All the ones that I have right now are like Forever 21, H&M, Claire's. They're not real silver or gold, so they really hurt my ears after a whole day of wearing them. And these do not. They're awesome. So, love these. So that's pretty much all my Christmas presents. Um, I did get one thing for myself. It was the Club Monaco Double Breasted Boyfriend Blazer, which I had on my site as one of the things I wanted. It came in charcoal and it came in black. I decided on black just because it was less trendy. It was less Alexander Wang. It was more something to wear for a long time. And I also decided on the black one because the material is a little thinner. You can wear it in more seasons. You can layer with it. It's just, uh, yeah, it's just going to be a little bit more of a useful piece. And it goes with more things. It has these great little striped cuffs, and I really, really like it. It looks really good with, like, skinny jeans, and it looks good with uh, mini dresses. That's pretty much it. I wouldn't wear it with anything that's a little bit longer, because then I just look kind of dowdy. Yeah, Christmas haul, done. Um, ooh, my computer's going to die, so I'll go through this quickly. I have what I'm reading right now. I just finished The Blind Side, which was a great book. If you just like a feel-good story, the whole story about Michael Orr is really interesting. It's really interesting to know how much um, a person's environment can affect the way that their life turns out. It's really 
I don't know, it's, it's, a, it's a cool read. And even if you don't like football, you'll like it. Although it does give you a lot of insight into the game, and so you can learn a little bit more about football. Um, I enjoyed it. Right now I'm reading Spotted, which is the Gossip Girl episode guide. It just gives you um, information about like where the cast goes in the episodes, clothing that they wear, just kind of secrets behind the scenes kind of stuff that maybe you didn't realize. Um, good quotes from each episode. Um, it's a cute book. I mean, I'm not going to say it's a must-buy, but I'm enjoying it. And then I'm rereading for like the hundredth time my favorite book, Pride and Prejudice, because I've been watching the movie a lot, and um, I haven't read it in probably about a year or two, so I'm reading that again, and I, this is my favorite book ever written, and I just, I just love this book. Anyway, read it. If you haven't read this, read it. All of Jane Austen's stuff's amazing, but that one's my favorite. Um, as for what I'm watching, Criminal Minds has like taken over my life. Um, you notice if you follow my, my Tumblr, because I've had a ton, ton of pictures on it. And it's just a show about FBI profilers. They track, like, serial killers and stuff like that. It's really, really interesting. And it's actually a lot better than CSI, which is one of my favorite shows. So that tells you how high, highly I enjoy this. Um, the only shows I really like better than Criminal Minds right now are um, Friday Night Lights <laughs> and True Blood. Other than that, Criminal Minds is number one. It stars Mandy Patinkin, who was in Princess Bride. He was in Dead Like Me, which is another show I love. Uh, there's Shamar Moore is in it, who's right here. He's from Young and the Restless. Um, my other favorite people in it are, I'll show you on this side because the sticker's covering it, JJ, which is ooh, right here. She was in Virgin Suicides, and she's Canadian. Girl right here is amazing, too. She's from Sopranos, and uh, she's only in season one and a bit of season two, so that kind of gives you a spoiler, but... Um, she's really, really good in it as well. This is Matthew Gray Gubbler right here. He plays Agent Reed. He's my favorite one. I'm kind of obsessed with him and have pictures of him all over my Tumblr. But I really like him. He's a great character on the show and he seems like a pretty funny guy. I follow him on Twitter um, as well. So, um, I'm done season one. I'm on to season two. I'm almost done that. Um, I've seen tons of other episodes because I've been watching it on A&E. They've been doing a lot of marathons. So she, they did one Christmas Day and New Year's Day which I watch for like nine hours of Criminal Minds. <laughs> and uh, I've seen most of season five, which is on right now, because I watched them on demand on my computer. Um, but yeah, I'm loving it. So see this if you haven't seen it. I highly recommend. Okay, last two things quickly. I'm going to talk about two new Mac products. Um, I'm waiting for the Liberty of London collection to come out in April, because there's a couple of things there that I really like. But until then... I've been liking these two lip products. One is a lip conditioner. It's in Feeling Good. It's from their new, one of their new collections. I don't remember what it's called, but they still have it. So it's a nice um, neutral. And then the plush glosses are my favorite lip products from MAC. And I always use Fulfilled, which is my favorite, favorite gloss. But this is a new one. It's called Big Baby. And it's just a bit more of a shimmery, um, brownie pink, and I'm wearing it right now. It's very neutral, but shimmery, and um, I love the smell of these. They smell like those kind of sugar cookies that come in a blue tin that have like crystallized sugar on top. I know these used to sell them a lot when I was a kid. I don't know if you really sell them anymore, but we used to eat them always at holiday time. That's the smell of it. It's kind of like a sugary, buttery smell. And they do plump, but they don't burn your lips like some cinnamon infused lip plumpers. You just kind of tingle a little bit, so highly recommend the this color, Big Baby, and also Fulfilled, which is my favorite one. All right, well, I'm gonna say goodbye because this video is getting 10 minutes, um, but I'll see you guys soon with a couple new videos, and make sure you check out the